and let it go for free. They're gonna continue to engage. Ooh. There goes a big Numion blast. And Sakun, best player, finding Zia. That's gonna be another kill. Noble Zane able to find one as well. Zia will fall to ADC. Oh. No longer standing for BTK. Hoon able to find best player. Zane finding basic retribution in BTK's favor. Should be able to secure this Lord and able to win that trade. But they're gonna go in. I think they're gonna try and close it out. They're gonna try and take match point away from Cloud9. Oh. There goes the knockup, the stun, and Mark Cutie will fall. Nas left alone all by himself, wondering how did I get here? And BTK will reign supreme and secures game number four against Cloud9. Yeah, if you thought they were out, you don't know BTK. Still signs of life showing up in this when it comes down to crunch time. Their inhibitor turrets, it's, it's a completely full 180 for the Bloodthirsty Kings. And now the play on the way for the bot side. Cold World, Immortality being, no, that's going to be the winner. Crown Zia able to take him down, though, with the Lord intact. Numbers in BTK's Ooh. favor. They're looking to take game number five. Numbers down for the side of Cloud9. Mark Cuban falls. Zia finding basic best player by himself. And BTK looking to win the trade. Best player finds Shark. Gets a triple kill. Finds Moba Zane. But no more minions in play. May have bought him a window of opportunity. Some breathing room. And they're able to hold up. Look at the health of the base crystal. Seven that seconds for is... Cold World. <laughs> That is amazing right now. Like, I can't believe... Oh, this might be it. Go, oh, Frigid Glacier. Not going to buy Cloud9. The time needed. And BTK able to take game number five against Cloud9. Oh, here's a crazy play, though. Conceal called in. Shark oh. not going to connect with the spatial oh. light. Oh, my goodness. Able to get it. Marquini finding Shark. Zia finding basic. Wait a second. That's going to be a one-for-one -one trade. What? Will they be able to get more? Cobra very low. Zia. 50% HP, minions may be the difference here. BTK still pushing through. Best player very low, Chicken able to find it. And BTK takes the base crystal. Ladies and gentlemen, we are going to a game number seven. It was kind of uh, trying to initiate. He didn't get the kill, they were mostly assists. Ooh, we're gonna go ahead and start a fight here. Yeah, G Kundo from Chicken may be the opportunity, but both sides fight it out. The Lancer and dropping down, and Zane able to get the retribution for the Bloodthirsty Kings. Hoon will punish best player. Marquita responds back, finding Hoon. That'll be a one for one trade and a turtle. Oh, to show through here. Ooh, we have Mark Cutie with a possible flank. Yeah, they're going to look for the trade. They're going to go in for the side lane instead of the turtle play. A smart decision. Zia Ooh. will be punished right there. Shark with the AOG a little late to the party. More damage, Able to top connect. side. A little bit more damage. Oh my goodness, a double G can go. AOG with the follow up and the crossbow tang. The finesse on the way. Basic will fall, but Zia may be punished. Best player able to shut him down. Shark needing to get back to safety. Hit with the I'm offended. Zane with the heavy left punch takes out Cold World. Best player gets the double. Finding Shark. Now three to one on the top side. Now two to three on the top side. And Zane and Hoon. Left to defend. Yeah, and with that, you're going to be... Them ...this series. You are seeing the Lord at about 45% HP. Chicken, a great engagement on the Nas with the way the Dragon set up. Ooh. AOG for Mark Cutie dropping down. We'll connect on the Shark. Chicken will fall. Mark Cutie will be the one to find him. One member down for the Bloodthirsty Kings, but they're still going to push in for this objective. Best Ooh. player a little bit quicker at the Retribution. Able to get it. 4C9 finds a kill on Zane and Zia. Three members down for BTK. Make that four as Cold World will find Shark. Goes down. Everyone takes a shot to the face there. And C9, they feel it. They have the momentum. They're going to start trying to make moves around the map. Look at everyone in a different lane. Yeah, you do see the way the dragon set up too from Chicken. Now forced to go back to safety as the Lord marching in on the top side. The knockup from the enhanced chains. A great setup. But can they follow through? Zia able to find Nats. Quick punish. Nats. Very low. Shark will fall. Cold World able to take him down. That is going to be a one for one trade for both sides. Oh man, and just like that, a 7k gold lead for the side of Cloud9 down to high grounds of BTK. At this point, can they defend? Zia still dancing, still trying to make something work. Cloud9, I'm hanging out, no vision, and there's the Cold World basic combo at the bottom lane once again. Yeah, the split push in effect to be able to have the wave management. Oh. And now both sides find it out. Airborne knockup. Zane able to find that. That's huge. 
for the Bloodthirsty Kings, but they need to get back to safety. Look at the Lantern placement. Basic with the side play of the place. Oh. Duet to the full team. Best player finding Shark. That is going to be a one for one trade in the Ooh. mid lane. Crossbow tank activated, but the Winter Crown provides some time. Boom. We'll find Cold World. Basic goes back to safety to BMI. Mark Cutie finding Gia. They don't have the ADC. Oh. Zane. Takes down best player, no retribution. But man, just right now, already kind of limiting it down to a 3k gold lead uh, for the side of Cloud9. Uh, BTK oh. just is still in it, but... Zane, oh. a little bit of a miscalculated oh. play, now working in his favor, finding Basic, able to sustain himself, and who will fight Cold World? Did he just turn this around? The bait! Working in Zane's favor. Now Zia will shut down Mark Cutie. Huh. Only Nats and best player left to defend, and the Lord will go over to the Bloodthirsty Kings. We're talking one punch, one hit, a millisecond, one moment for, B for Moba Zane to take out Basic and completely put this game into their hands. And just like that, turned it around with one hit. Takes down Basic, three down for the side of Cloud9, BTK have, a, uh, I mean, at least a, a short answer just now and a 2K gold lead. Look for a possible punish, but they're gonna go in and try and burst down this Lord. But I'm standing, I'm pacing in front of the monitor right now. Anything could happen. I think Cloud9 needs to do what they've been doing. Take it slow, right? They can't rush this. I think when they overextend themselves, when they go for these big plays, that's when the mistakes start to come in. They cannot underestimate BTK at this point. I think they really just need to let BTK come to them, and there it is. Yeah, the initiation on the way. Zane able to find best player. Oh! Be able to get oh. another. Zia finding Ness. That's two down for Cloud9. Blaze went into the heart of the battle. Shark falling for the Bloodthirsty Kings, but not going to stop. BTK on the push. Oh. Minions in the mid lane. Oh! DLG chicken finding Marcuti. Moments away with one final strike. Cloud9 will be shut down by the Bloodthirsty Kings. The threat of fate has been severed, and they reclaim the crown as North America's champions. The whispers laid to rest. The doubts laid to rest. Cloud9 laid to rest as BTK reign victorious.